we see back here with the K900, this is the, the key fog, I keep staring at the key fog, but this is the K900, it's really nice, yeah. this one is for 63, this one's Yoda to the max, this is the inside, the speakers and all that, and over here has a lot of features in here though. You have to start the car, but this is for your sunshade, your heated seats, your climate control, your rear climate control. This is to show the screen. Actually at the front though. Um this is in here, the USB USB port in your charge port. And back here, you can go back here, open back here to your crew, if you want to put younger stuff. This is for your sunshade though, this is to yacht the door to open it, um, your ventral, um, this is the button to move the seat if you want to move forward, or back to get more room. But the driver's side will have it. The seat doesn't have, the seat doesn't have itself. Close, no, I don't have the self closing doors. This is the shrunk. The shrunk is very nice though. I like the mats in it. The mats feels nice inside. You'll see the other cars like that. This one has a power shrunk. You can yak it or you can yak it and close it. This one you can just close it, press and close it. And you got parking sensors too. One is K900. This one is the inside. So how you start it up, right? You put your foot on the brake. Put your foot on the brake. This one has, this one has the, um, what kind of engine? This one has the V6. It's actually borrowed from the Stinger though. I don't know how much output does it put up, but you can actually move it and options right here this is all the options it's a v6 twin turbo and you got memory seats three memory seats you got your phone mirrors you can fold your mirrors in the heated out of the mint and blind spotting um then you have your automatic lights your automatic wiper control your Yang keep assist right here. Your Yang, your Yang keep assist is right here. You can see when it's on. Your blind spot monitor. This is for your dim display. Like you can make it brighter or make it yellower. This is for your for your shrunk, your um gas, and your parking brake. And what's down here? Um, I love this navigate. This is all you do this navigation is all new. It's nice though. I like the resolution of it. It's a touch screen and you can do it from over here too. You can press back, menu, and all that. If you but this will cut out when you're driving, so you can't use this. You have to use this down here. So I like this. You go this comes in the higher end Kias. So, I like how this works, and it looks real nice inside, and it's just big and cool, stuff like that, and it has hard buttons right here to do stuff you want, and you can put a button like if you want to program anything right here. Um, you have your mode, and you got your hill, this is like to press this, like if you want a hill, you take your foot off the brake and it holds the car. And then when you take your foot off the brake, it unlocks the brakes and you can go up and set rolling back. I don't see any out of these wires, chargers. You can put your phone right here to charge your phone. USB port and another charge port. Oh, just have a 60 rule camera right here. It's not going to come on. Um, this is your parking sensors. This is your 60 rule camera. Let's see if I can put your foot on the brake. That's the camera. It shows you all around. And then when you put it in the verse, the sunshade comes down in the back. 
the resolution is nice. You can you can put navigation if you want navigation here. It shows you all around, so you can't really hit this car really. And it shows you different views around the place, your brightness, your settings, how you want it. Okay. You can show around the car, yeah, like if any kids running. I like the resolution. I know I think it has a front facing camera too, it shows right here too. So if you want to put it back into park. And then the sunshade goes back up too. So you got start stop, you got the sunshade. You can put it down manually if you want. It's electric too. Um you got more USB ports back here, you gotta gotta use. You can keep all your phones charged. These seats feel comfortable. They are ventilated and cool seats. And you got a heated steering wheel too and do zone. And this is the compartment. These seats are very comfortable. I like the steering wheel. The steering wheel is real nice. I drove the cousin of this car, the Hyundai, so this should drive very nice. Um Yeah. You got a head up spray over here, you can do other stuff to show your navigation. Um your other stuff like control you other stuff through this constant growth to feed the beast. Oh, so this side it shows that side and this side it shows over here in the screen. I like that though. And you can put on cruise control. This is all that stuff. Menus and stuff. Shows your um stuff like that. And you want to put it in sport mode, it shows all all the doors open. So you wanna turn it off, you press this button right here. You got paddle shifters back here. I don't think anybody driving this car could use the paddle shifters, but it's nice. Um, and you got a sunroof. You got a sunroof right here. You got your light controls right here. To turn them on when you open the door. Turn on the east side. Um, you got LD lights. It's right here too. I got the LD lights. And I like how they make this. I think it's a speaker. And your sunglasses holder. Your home link, and you got your what key it is you. Um, ask key for roadside assistance. Your navigation ask for help, and it's out of dimming mirror too. So, and it tears on for the out of dimming mirrors outside the car. So if you need brightness coming to you, I got the wood interior though. This is all wood, and it's nice. And you got your clock. It looks nice and heavy. And these are the seats too. You got a lot of ways you can adjust the seats. These adjust the arm bars and all that stuff. And you can adjust the rest to how high you want the rest. The, uh, the um, headrest. And this is power too. And this is all tied into the um, system too when you say one of them and you press the like you say you press number one this will come back from the ass memory you press it and it's on the passenger side too so you can um press that too you can save it on the passenger side you don't see a yellow car is like that so you can save it on the passenger side and i love these speakers though these are aluminum speakers um this wrap it up and this Kia you did you did 10 years warranty with it and it comes with all wheel drive. Um let me show you how they yacht the vehicle. Oh you gonna shut the door. I can you actually yacht it from right here. You yacht the vehicle right here. But the doors are open so I can't yacht it. When you yacht it the mirrors will fold in and then we'll yacht got the car. Hold on, me yakking in the car door. So Yanni, you keep this in your pocket or pocketbook. Um, you can press this 
and it folds in the mirrors and yak it and then you have to press it again to open the doors and it goes for the rear doors too you can do for the rear doors you can yak, yak the rear doors the rear doors can yak all the doors then you open it to open all the doors when you touch one of the the passion or the drive the rear doors it will open all doors these are the wheels on them these are these are the wheels I like the heavy arms though on them the heavy arms is real nice I like the wheels on them too and it, it has a chrome strip cone the grass it has like full LDs and they put the reverse brake light down here this is really like a steal from the price 63 the other options you get in in this car is a real nice deal and you get all wheel drive with this model too so this wrap it up for the Kia 900 Shao O at Kia and you get the rear camera right there so this Shao O at CBC Auto Box and Shout out at CBC Auto Box. Subscribe and I have more videos be coming soon about this car. I mean other videos will be coming soon. Bye y'all. Uh.